uh, this is just devastating and heartbreaking to look at all of this video. Uh, was that first video you showed of us, uh, us people climbing out of the window or animals climbing out of the window? What was that scene? It, it was, and the homeowner obviously uh, didn't want to go on camera and talk about his situation. But yes, they had a dog and they were back in the house trying to get their belongings out of this house, which has, from what we can see, the most tornado damage right now. So yes, a very sad situation. They had the dog and they were trying to get their belongings. They were here with sheriff's deputies trying to get what they could, but they're not the only ones. Like I said, I mean, we can almost go down the block right here. You can see this big tree right here down behind me. And then the side of this house over here and then this driveway. Is this your house? Is inside. We believe the homeowner is in this house right over here. And you can see we're just walking down the street. We are in the Meadows subdivision, down basketball line. You can see the damage that was done. Doors and windows blown open. People who live here are trying to get back into their homes just to get what they can out of these homes and make sure that everything is locked up. Do you mind if we ask you a question, sir? Sure. Sorry to talk to you under these circumstances, but were you home yes. when the tornado came through? Me and my three kids. Did y'all take shelter? Yeah, we got in the bathroom right seconds before it hit. We're live right now on WDSU. What did, what did it sound like? I mean, nobody ever expects to go through something like this. A freight train. And it's scary. You know, everybody's crying. You know, it's just what you expect. You lost your house. Second time in what? Four years? Three years? Five years? With Isaac three years ago? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. The house is it's gone. How old are your children that were in the house, sir? Um, 14, 12, and 9. Everybody's okay? Thank you. Sorry to meet you under these circumstances. Mm -hmm. And you can see right now, this is a live look. We're in the Meadows subdivision. This was an area that was hit pretty hard, unfortunately, during Hurricane Isaac. You'll remember the president made a visit to this area. This is arguably one of the hardest hit areas after Hurricane Isaac. And you can see, just like this homeowner told us here in Laplace, second time in just over three years, and the damage here in the Meadows is massive. And you can imagine how frightening that situation is. I mean, you're talking about getting under uh, shelter and staircases or bathtubs or whatever it is to protect yourself and your children. Goodness. Three children. And yeah. like you mentioned, three years ago, the immense flooding that happened in Laplace and all through uh, those subdivisions. And now this where a mm. tornado knocks on your front door. This is uh, video.